Hey guys, Bizer here, time to find out what's good on the next episode of the Daily Special. So it is Tuesday, which means it is Tier Day Tuesday. So last week we had PU. P wow. Last week we had PU, so we're moving up on the Smogon tier, so we're bringing NU this time. So let's see how these poke and these pokes uh these pokes do, because we don't got no giga impact missing. We ain't got no slacking that needs those glasses. So let's see if these Pokemon have their contacts and their glasses on. They got their eye surgery. They're ready to go. Let's click that challenge button and let's find some of opponents to deal with. Um, let's see how that's going to go. So actually, oh, I didn't go over my team. We have our Choice Scarf Typhlosion. Focus Sash Cacturn. Um, we have our Focus Sash Cacturn. We have our Choice Specs Miss Magius. We have our Life Orb Pyroar. We have our Leftovers Contrary Malmore. And of course... We have Mega Steelix, since Mega Steelix is actually NU. So you guys saw the team before, sorry I forgot to go over what they are, but I just told you what they are right now. So our opponent is bringing a straight OU powerhouse, they've got Rotom Wash, Gengar, Greninja, Talonflame of Goodness, Garchomp, and Clefable. So Steelix can handle the Talonflame no problemo. It can handle that no problemo. What do I want to do about the Garchomp? Actually, the Pyroar can do some damage, too. Pyroar can do some damage, too. Thinking about Steelix, Pyroar, and Miss Magius. You want to lead with Pyroar. Bring Miss Magius and Steelix. That's who we're bringing. Let's see how that's going to work. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not sure. Shall see. Our opponent is still deciding what do they want to bring. Because they got no idea. They don't know. They, they're like, what is this team that my opponent just got? And it's all NU Pokemon. You've got It's OU versus NU right now. That's what it is. OU versus NU. So he's got the Gengar. Which means that I can't Hyper Voice everything, obviously. So Gengar is going to lead with the Greninja. That is a terrible lead on my part. The Greninja is going to outspeed me. So that sucks. <laughs> that sucks a butt ton. That sucks a butt ton. Uh -huh -huh. Dang it. Welp, welp, welp. Yeah. I don't think we won this one, guys. I don't think we won this one. I outspeed it. What? What the heck? Why do I outspeed? It's a crit. I don't know if that crit mattered, but why do I out? Why did I outspeed the Greninja? What the heck? Okay. Sure. Sure. Uh, that's going to do a decent amount to the Garchomp. And this Earthquake is going to kill me. Uh, so that's... Well then. It's not expecting that Pyroar to outspeed the, uh... To outspeed the, um... Not expecting to outspeed a uh, Greninja. I uh, just really wasn't. I just really wasn't. We went for the Shadow Ball there. Try Specs Shadow Ball is going to take out the Garchomp. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm just an on why the Pyro outspeed the Greninja. What? What was that? Like a? Uh, I, I don't know. Oh. Oh dear. Huh. Huh. I'm gonna go into Steelix just because I want to. I want to be able to energy ball this thing, and Steelix can't really do much to it. So yeah, we're going to. Most likely gonna go for the Hydro Pump. He goes for the, yeah. Okay, he's going for the Hydro Pump. He doesn't miss it. Steelix is dead. Um. Yep. Bye bye Steelix. Uh, that's fine. Our shiny Steelix did not get to Mega Evolve. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. Um, but we do have the super effective energy ball. 
Are you scarfed? No, you're not scarfed. There are specs. Let's see how much damage that's going to do. Enough to one shot and take out the Rotom. And that is why I did what I did. That is why I did what I did. And we win! P or NU defeated OU. NU defeated OU. So that's lovely. That's pretty cool. We get a win. I'm still shocked at the Pyro outspeeding the Greninja. I don't know what what uh what a EV spread that my opponent was running on that Greninja. But it's definitely not max speed, because Pyroar does not outspeed Greninja, that's for sure. Yes, I do want to continue battling. Let's go on and find battle number two. With that battle box, and, uh, yeah. Because our Scarfer is our Typhlosion, so I don't know what, what happened there. Not quite sure. Oh well, it's fine. Fine with me. Good to know that a Life Orb Hyper Voice from a Pyroar will one-shot a Greninja. Oh, no, I critted. I did crit, so... I'm not sure if that crit mattered. It may have. But we found our second opponent, and they are bringing a mix tier, but mostly OU with some other stuffs. Got a Talonflame, Ferrothorn, Mawile, Configurus, Slacking. Now we know how lovely Slacking is. And a Starmie. So Pyroar hits two of them. Super effective. Hmm. <laughs> Starmie and Typhlosion. Typhlosion's gonna put in work. Typhlosion can put in work. I'm thinking maybe bringing that bad boy. Got the Cacturn as well. Cacturn's gonna hit some things. Cacturn can hit some things. So you know what? I think I'm gonna lead with Typhlosion. Bring Cacturn. And Malmar doesn't really do much, so I don't think I'm going to bring Malmar. I'm going to bring Pyroar or Miss Magius. Magius hits you. Takes the Configurus and the Starmie. That's it. Pyroar can hit the Ferrothorn, the Mawile, and the Configurus because it has Dark Pulse and the Starmie. Let's bring Pyroar. Alright. That's who we're bringing. That's who we're bringing. Let's see how our opponent... Let's see how we go against Josh. Let's see how Josh does. <clears throat> let's see here. Alright, Josh. Who are you sending out? You're going to lead with the Talon Flame. That's lovely. I really did not expect the Talon Flame to be coming through here. I really did not. <laughs> I really did not, so that's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. Uh, I guess we gotta do that. We're gonna go for the Brave Bird. And he's probably got the Ferrothorn, and yeah, well, I'm gonna get a lot of recoil off on, this ta on the, uh... On the Talon Flame, so... Yeah. Um... What do you have? A poison Jab. That's the only thing that you can hit the Talon Flame with. Because I can't go for Sucker Punch because you out-prioritize me since Brave Bird gets that priority. Um. Yep. That's unfortunate. That is unfortunate. Let's see how much this recoil does. Hopefully, uh, okay, that'll take me down to the Focus Sash. You'll get some nice recoil damage, and hopefully this poison jab will be enough to take you out. Hopefully, yes! Okay, the Talon Flame is gone. The Talon Flame is gone. So let's see here. Who do you got? You got the Ferrothorn, you wall me. Probably brought Ferrothorn. Why would you not bring Ferrothorn? Let's go out into Ferrothorn. Let's go. If I can kill myself. Something. Yep, there's Ferrothorn! Now, why did it take you so long to, to go out to Ferrothorn? There was no reason to take that long to go out to Ferrothorn. None. None. I'm gonna go on to Pyroar. I'm gonna, I'm gonna save this Cacturn. No reason to not save it. No reason to not save it. Probably gonna Leech Seed. He's in a Power Whip. Alright. That wow, that actually did more than I thought. 
That did more than I thought it would. It's gonna withdraw. Who do you have? Disarm me, okay. But I have absolutely no reason to not go into Cacturn, because I got the Water Absorb. And I'm immune to your other stab. So... I'm going to play Obvious McObvious here. Ah, okay, so it does go for the Dazzling Gleam. Ah, yeah... See, I don't. I never know how to play in battle spot because if I play with prediction, then they don't do what I'm predicting, and then when I don't play with prediction, they do what I was what I would have predicted. Because I mean, I wanted to stay in with Pyroar. It was fairly obvious that this thing was going to uh, to uh, yeah. Well, oh well, oh well. You, s you locked into Dazzling Gleam? You're think you're taking a while to decide what. No, okay, you're not. Okay, and then you land your Hydro Pump. So that's bye, bye Pyroar. Bye. Life Orb. I didn't. Did I not see the Life Orb before? Guess not. Well, I mean, I had to. Uh, had I stayed in and gone for the Dark Pulse, I obviously would have won. Obviously would have won. But, I, yeah. Like I said, I, don't, I guess I should just play Battle Spot like I would play a competitive battle. And then that way, it's, I just play it the exact same way that I would the same way, uh, as I would that. I should just play it the same way as I would that. Because, I mean, it's different, you know, with Battle Spot. You only got three Pokemon that they have, so you don't know exactly what they can bring in. But normally, I'm pretty good at predicting. When they do do the predictions, they do what I wanted. So, like, I wanted to go for... I know I didn't say it, but I wanted to go for Dark Pulse against Ferrothorn. Because I was thinking the Starmie would come in. But, yeah. Anyway, we got Suicune, Sylveon, Aerodactyl, Superior, Salamence, and an Entei. So, we got two of the Legendary Beasts. Okay. Okay. Mm. So we gotta bring Malmar, uh, which goes perfect because it doesn't do much to anything. That's good. Glad I gotta bring that. Um, hmm. Suicune is gonna be the problem. That's the problem. That is our problem. So, if we bring Malmar, Cacturn, and I'm thinking Miss Magius? Hit you, you. It hits everything for good damage. Yeah. Who do I want to lead with, though? Let's just lead with Malmar. Bring Miss Magius and Cacturn. Alright, let's hit that confirm button. That's what we're bringing. That's who we're bringing. Let's see how that works out. Not sure. I'm not sure. I am not sure. And honestly, I mean, I have to bring Malmar because I haven't brought in it yet. But there's really nothing that it can do. Entei. Alright, you're going to put that pressure on me. And we can rock slide. We can rock slide, or we can get a superpower off. Do that. Let's do that and see how that works. Let's see how that works. Your opponent is deciding what they want to do. They're deciding, do I stay in? No ghost types on my opponent's team, so we don't have to worry about superpower not working. Stay in and go for the Stone Edge, and that misses. Ooh, that sucks. I'm sorry about that, because that... Oh, that Superpower does a lot. That Superpower does a decent amount. Makes me now want to go for another one. 
Let's go for another one. Went for stone it. I am so sorry. That miss definitely mattered. That miss definitely mattered. I am sorry about that. Comes a sacred fire. Gets the burn. Wow, okay. So there's hacks for hacks. There's hacks for hacks. Uh, burn puts me at minus two. I'm at plus three, so I'm at plus one now. So, yeah. There's hacks for hacks. Hacks for hacks, because that burn uh, that burn severely matters, obviously, with my Malmar. Um, yeah. Yep, who do you have here? Superior. Alright. Um, I'm gonna just go for the... Let's see, which one's stronger? Psycho Cut. Clan Crits. They're both the same. Feeling Psycho Cut. I'm feeling the Psycho Cut. Leaf Storm, so it's special. Alright. Actually, dang. Con I thought Contrary was not allowed. Why can't I trade you if it's not allowed? Interesting. Okay, so we have our opponent using an, an elite. Wait. No, I guess it is not allowed now. It's been. It's the ninth in Japan, so I guess I can. It is allowed. Okay. Well then. Wow. Wow. The hacks. The hacks are real. The hacks are real. Hacks are real. The hacks are real. Smack yourself. No, it doesn't. I'm gonna go into Cacturn. And let's just. Sucker Punch. Could be safe and just attack, because I do have the Focus Sash. Should have probably done that, but we'll see. Well, I mean, if he doesn't do an attacking move this turn, then I'll just attack next turn. Fine. Now, like I said, I have the Focus Sash. So, yeah. He's discerning. What do I want to do? Are you going to attack, or are you going to Sucker Punch? I'm going to Sucker Punch this turn, and then I'm going to Poison Jab next turn. I've just told you my strategy. That is what I'm going to do. If I don't, if the Sucker Punch fails, obviously. Nope, it does not fail, so by Superior. And we have... So Contrary Superior is now legal now, apparently. Okay. They have updated the battle spots. I see. Oh, I see. Predicting the dragon dance of some kind. Yes, the dragon dance. Which is why I went for the attack. Oh, you're bulky. We get the poison. Oh, because the, uh... Dang intimidate, huh? I think we lost here. Pretty sure we lost here. I'm pretty sure we lost here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we lost. There's the Mega. Why did you not Mega last time? Why did you not Mega last time? There's the Double Edge, so he is going to attack. Could have gone for the Sucker Punch. Some nice recoil damage. I actually I win. I win actually, because if he doesn't attack, he dies from poison. And if he does attack, he dies from the sucker punch. So yeah. Hey, we win! Cacturn taking out the Mega Salamance! All by his lonesome. All by his lonesome. I predicted that D-dance, so that's why I didn't go for Sucker Punch the first time, so. Kudos on me, and I got the point. 
That was, I'm sorry, uh, opponent. That was an incredibly... Ha I, I, I completely acknowledge that the only reason I won that is because of hacks. You missed all those stone edges. You missed those leaf storms. And then you got the poison from the, the that. I don't know if that was Game Freak's way of saying we are so sorry about last Tuesday. Here, we'll make it up for you in this game by giving you some hacks. So, I don't know. But we all I know is we got a win. So, we got two wins today. So, that's nice. That's good. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, see that like button. Subscribe if you want to see more episodes of the Daily Special. See some more battles and what all this fun stuff that goes on when we do this. Remember to also click the link in the description below to follow me on Twitter because that's where I post updates for the channel and all those good things and stuff. And I guess I will see you guys later.